Sam Clement, Freddy Dennis, Hello. thanks for your time. Of course, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so you guys are like the shadows of uh, Queen Charlotte and uh, King George. Mm -hmm. uh, you both are British. Mm -hmm. right? Yes. Yeah, yeah. So what do you think of this view of a uh, part of the history of your country uh, from the, the, the mastermind of Sonder Rhymes? <laughs> I mean, I mean, I, this is captured it brilliantly. I mean, we it, it is based on on history and, and and certain facts, but it's very much uh, a, a fictional telling of these characters. So, you know, there's an essence of the history, but she's created a story that that, that she wants to tell, um, uh, with and, and made very intentional choices uh, for many aspects of the show um, to touch on what it would have been like historically, but then also reflect the society that we live and want to live. Um, so we took essences of the history, but then had a blank canvas to kind of paint around that. Um, what, what do you yeah, I mean, I mean, it was, there were very much elements of fiction. It is a fiction, as they stated at the beginning, but that kind of made it, as actors, uh, sort of more joyful yeah. to play with as well. I Imagination think. could just run wild a little bit more. Mm. And then, at uh, what time do you, did you learn that you were going to be in this show? Because uh, Bridgerton became so popular at the end mm. of 2020 when it came out. And I guess this was obviously later. Yeah, I and, found and out. How did you feel? <laughs> yeah, fe February of last year. So February 2022. 2022 yeah. is when we found out. We, we'd, uh, we'd done an initial tape for it back in 2021 at the end of the year. Yeah. So I suppose that's the first time we heard there was some sort of Bridgerton spin-off. But no one, we had no idea really what it was we were we were reading for and it um, felt amazing yeah it was it was the most insane uh, moment finding out I sort of never believed I'd ever be part of something no. this, this big and then you know as a, as a first job are you ready to become super popular because that was happening with Netflix shows that are popular all over the world yeah. <laughs> I don't know well, so let's, not, let's not speak before Thursday <laughs> yeah. Yeah, maybe we won't it all still feels very normal at the moment yeah. Yeah. yeah what was the most challenging like filming this show for you guys uh, for me, um, the dancing. I'm not a mover. You know? uh, I, f I found that, because I'd never done anything like that before, I found it quite difficult to, um, to, to stay in time, actually. Um, <laughs> but it, that also made it the most joyful, because I learnt a lot about myself and also about how to, to waltz. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, what about you? I think um, with the nature of you know, television and how it's created, there's like last-minute changes and... I like to have like my dialogue learnt two or three days in advance and sometimes you've got to be able to change that quite quickly. So I think one of the challenges for me was trying to train myself to learn dialogue as quickly as possible. Yeah. Yeah. And was it very different from what you had worked uh, before? Or Yeah, I mean, a lot of my, my background of work has been theatre. So um, I've, I've done the odd film and the episodes of television, but not like a long-running television. So it was... It was, it was different in terms of creating an arc over like six episodes, I suppose. Um, but it was it was great. I would I want to continue doing that. Mm -hmm. It was different for me because <laughs> I'd just graduated and I've I've had one line in a show that has never been aired. <laughs> so it was basically the first thing I ever did. So yeah, great it, experience. <laughs> I, I met the best, yeah. the best thing. Slightly overwhelming, but the best thing ever. Thank you so much, guys. Thank, Thank you, you for your time. I need to know what is going on at Buckingham House. Your marriage cannot go wrong. What's happening? I do not want to fight. I want to fight with you. Fight with me. Fight for me.